Hello, everybody. I hope everybody's having a good day. I was going to do a little quick video here. I'm fixing some uh, beef stew, putting it in the crock pot. I was going to show y'all what all I put in mine, which actually this is probably the first time I've ever made this type, but I'm going to try it out. I'm going to let it cook overnight. I've already got my beef stew in the crock pot over here. I'll show you. Let's see how this thing here works. I guess y'all can see in there, can't you? I already got my beef stew in there. I don't think it's showing. Well, maybe it is now. Okay. But anyways. Beef stew for the crock pot. Put this thing back over here. I'll show you what all goes in it here. I already got my beef in there. It's like. Uh, two pounds of uh, beef tips. Okay. I'm going to add a veggie mix in it. Okay, here, yeah, let's see. Two cans French onion. Campbell's soup. Two cans of that. Two cans of diced potatoes. Two cans of beefy mushroom. Campbell soup. Two packs of brown gravy. And one pack of beef stew seasoning. Hope everybody's having a good day today. Tomorrow be my birthday. I'll be 54 year old. Oh, yeah, and y'all too, I'm going to uh, put some uh, beef stock in it also. Probably put all that in there. It's half full here, so. Actually, about two cups. I'm going to go ahead and pour this in here. I don't know if y'all watched a video the other day that Stephen Hodges made uh, where he made that bird feeder. Went in the woods there and uh, cut them up some little branches and that bird feeder turned out awful nice. I thought he'd done a real good job on it. Don't let it go to your head, Stephen Hodges. I'm bragging on you. Ah. I watched his grandma's video this morning, too, where he put the big chicken coop together that uh, Bloomin' had sent him. Boy, Bloomin', you're a blessing. That was a very nice gift. And Miss Helen, boy, she's tickled to death with that gift. She was running circles around in that thing whenever Stephen got it put together. All right, y'all, I'm going to go ahead and put all this in here. Oh, yeah, y'all, I got me a tripod. My mom got me one for Christmas. So that way y'all can watch uh, me add the stuff in the pot over here. Usually I'd have to set the phone down and had it in. Yeah, I'm going to let this cook all night long after I put it in there. 
put it on low the crock pot just let it cook all night slow and it should be good to go tomorrow be having a little bit of beef stew here okay I got it in a that's a can of sliced taters there. Okay, I'll show y'all I added a can of sliced taters. This is the only can they had, and it was all mashed up whenever I got it. Somebody dropped it at the grocery store. But I'm like, I, I'm going to get a, get them anyways. All righty. Hope everybody had a good Christmas and a happy new year. There's my veggie I put in there. Veggie oh. Put that in there. Let's a little bit more than that can. Let's press that in there. Come out there. Okay. A couple more cans of these diced tomatoes. Or not tomatoes, but potatoes. I ain't going to put no tomatoes in it. I don't think tomatoes is good with beef stew in it. Some people might put tomatoes in theirs, but I'm just going to put taters and green beans, carrots, corn. Yeah, that is, reminds me. I've got another thing of corn here I'm wanting to put in there, too. Yeah, it might not even fit it. Let's see. I'm already getting about full. I mean, a big spoon here. All this stuff might not go a big one. Be it in there. Let's see, I got another can of taters that goes in here. Two cans of this French onion. Got to get that in there. My beef stew mix here. Might have to leave out of it. Can of taters out of them in there after it cuts down some. All right, that was my base stew seasoning mix. These are my two package. This is a uh, brown gravy mix. One. Here comes one. Get this stuff in there. Hopefully, these two cans right here fit. You definitely won't put these in there. That's that French onion soup mix. Two cans of it. Mix all that up, boys. Let that cook overnight, man. it would be good. Good to go tomorrow. I'll come back occasionally and stir it down every hour or so before I go to bed at night and 
in during the night if I wake up to have to go to the bathroom or something, I'll uh, come in here and stir it. Oh, Captain, uh, apologies, man. That's a main rooster, ain't it? Jumping on Grandma like that, bruising her leg up. I was saying there in the video, if I was there, I'd be uh, hanging Captain Hodges is up by his feet for about an hour. That rooster, he needs to calm down and leave Miss Helen alone. Miss Helen will take that stick to him one of these days and break his neck. <laughs> but anyways, y'all. That's is today's video. I hope everybody has a blessed day. Remember, Jesus loves us all. Always uh, keep everyone that's needing prayers in their prayers. You know, I always like uh, praying for the ones that needs prayers. And I would appreciate it if y'all would head over to my YouTube channel. Subscribe to it. I am Wilkes County Boy over there. Uh, like, share my videos. Get them out there. There's going to be more upcoming videos I'm going to make. And together we can grow. So everyone have a blessed day. Until the next video. Y'all take care now.